relations with Poland have gone down. You can see that he's actually wanting my territory, so I think that alliance that's probably going to fail at some point. Hopefully not too early in the game, but... Tonic Order Allied to Bohemia. Okay. Now I should probably buy a new general before my army tradition goes down much more. PP points are actually over 50. Sadly I couldn't humiliate, but that actually gives me more mon more monarch points, which is great. I could insult someone, but I'm actually a truce with all the people who I have rivaled. Sweden, Denmark. I could rival Denmark, but I probably want to rival Muscovy next. So I'm not going to yet do that. Uh, what was I doing? Right, general. That was like mind went blank then. So I'm going to hire a new general. 50. Okay. And he's terrible. So we haven't got much luck there. But he's better than my last guy. I'm not going to keep on spending a ton of points on I'm going to wait. Hello. Having said that, I ain't going to need a general there, aren't I? So yeah, let's try another time. That's more like it. Okay. Better roll there. Sweden's troops too, but uh, it's possible Sweden might come help me out. Right, I've got some forts as well. I don't need... Is there a fort there? Yes, there is. There isn't one there. There is... Right, probably going to scrap Mammal's fort, I believe. Or am I? If I become Kurland or Courland later on, they get a f their capital moves to there, so I'd have a fort there automatically. So I probably should plan my where my forts are around that um, idea really. I don't want to have forts on the coast in particular because coastal provinces uh, basically have more, well, there's more stuff that can be built there. Docks and shipyards, so I'd probably prefer my forts inland, but probably going to keep the one in Mammal, or am I? Now I'll, keep, I'll get rid of the one in Mammal, uh, so we can scrap that by clicking there, so that'll save me some money. My, what's this? That's on one still. Truce runs out in 57 August. I'm waiting for that to reach 80 before coring it. Right, they're actually moving. Sweden's going to help out after all. I have left this on now, haven't I? Right, good. Because I'm going to need it. So let's... Do I attack with... Su I can actually go through that fort then. That's surprising. Can Sweden... This is a weird situation, to be honest. Uh, looks like I've finished relations with Muscovy. I'm going to cap out my relations with Lithuania just in case, for some reason, they get a bit more hostile with us. I can hire a Merc. Save our manpower.
they may actually go for them straight away and then I can move in and help. That will probably be the best scenario for me. Waste Sweden's manpower and have a chance of winning. I think I'm going to have to let Sweden take that, siege that down and then move in. Because I can't be sure if Sweden would support if I move in there. And that wouldn't solve the problem of the fort being sieged anyway. Right, can I increase that anyway? I could support... Give subsidies to rebels. I think that's the only way I can actually get more power here without getting another rival. I don't want to do... Maybe I should do Denmark. But I want to do Muscovy in a not too distant future. When can I remove... Oh, actually, Novgorod would go, wouldn't it? If I vassal them up anyway. Teutonic Order would all... Yeah, let's do Denmark. Okay. That's gone up. Let's put time up as well. That's way too slow. Poland still hasn't finished that war. I actually haven't caught up yet, so... Let's see if I can do that. Right, let's hit the minimum. So, Memel and Konigsberg... I'm just going to wait until it goes before calling it. That way I can be sure that they're at the cheapest point. Rather than figure it out mathematically. I think it's 10% off, so it should be 153 for that one anyway. So I did figure it out mathematically. Whoa! What the hell? Did Sweden get killed? I missed it. How the hell did that happen? Okay, that was not good. If I'd have helped, I probably would have won that battle. Okay, they're in real danger of losing these places now. Let's count to Poland. What's the terrain? That's crap terrain actually, so it's not a very good place to defend. There is a river there, what's the maneuver? One, probably got better than that. Okay. Uh, Population to Pomerania who want to ally. Probably gonna conquer Riga and switch my alliance to Pomerania at some, well after I've done Novgorod. Be speeding up. They don't even look damaged after taking out the Swedish army as well. I assume they took it out, I didn't see it. Right, Sweden might help out now. Let's hire another Merc just to be sure. I'm going to wait for Sweden to build up a bit and then I'll move in hopefully to help. Right, so conflict and protest of the taxes, corporations, port duties, navy requisitions, trade and customs policies were quite frequent and often had counterproductive effects. Right, mercantilism is very hard to get increase it. It's really, really good. Increases your trade money a lot. So I'm going to take a Diplo hit, which is quite a big one as well, sadly. But Hansa just a good one. Denmark. Denmark's not going to... Do very well in this game at all, but looks at things. Sweden seemed to be really powerful at the time being. I mean, they've added like Swedish culture over here. I think they had like tiny bits of culture in areas around here, but not like the whole province. But ha the game can't represent that. Okay. 
Okay, someone who's actually from Finland or Sweden would know a lot more than me though. Uh, Mel Jacks is from Riga. I'm gonna turn that down. I'm probably gonna have to cancel at some stage. Right, they're incoming there. Not much I can do about this. I'm gonna have to let it happen, I think. No, Sweden doesn't help out, I'm in trouble. Right, Poland and Teutonic Order finally made peace. They didn't take Danzig, but they took all of the rest of the territory. Wow, I'm surprised by that. They actually on good terms with me still. Balanced personality, so that's that's probably still quite warlike, to be honest. Maybe. Maybe not, I'm not sure. Muscovy usually has the war like personality administrator. No, it doesn't. What's this? The personality determines how they play, basically. Twenty-four days. How long did it get there? Tenth of April. You know, high enough one. Let's make sure of this. Okay, so that ran out. We got a bonus for Eclipse in them. Probably means I have to get rid of my embargo on them though. It's not showing up the banner yet, so I'm not going to do it. Right, Sweden I could do with a hand. Right, we actually have... They have the same military tactics as us. Your rebels tactics go up when you raise yours, sadly. I think I'm actually going to lose that. I thought I might win this, and I'm not. I need Sweden's help. Uh, this is a shit situation. So what am I gonna do? I could have, could hire a crazy amount of mercs and go after them. When can I retreat? Twenty-first. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to have to do here. Right, so retreat to there. Oh dear, is it? Right, don't get a choice about where I retreat to. I'm going to try and build up a ton of mercs now. Right, some smirk up here. Merka just got built. They moved on to it and killed it before I could get him out. Do they repair? I assume they do. I need to uh, group them up and see how many I've got. Uh, Sweden's rebuilding. Got a few years before I'm gonna start a war. Uh, so that's, that's capped out. Let's start improving relations with Hungary. Has that gone down a bit? Looks like it has, luckily for me. Okay, let's uh, 
combine those. Let's buy cavalry here. How many have I got? Fourteen. Wait for these to come back up, probably buy two or three more mercs and attack them again. Need to get their approval back up, morale back up. Uh, would Lithuania help me? They might do. They have access, but they're not... Well, is this guy coming up here? It might be. That on there, see if that does anything. Right, that's replenishing sadly. Right, Sweden's coming in to help. Group up there. Such mercs. Um, what should we do about that? What's the manpower? Twelve hundred under. Thirteen. It's higher. How much am I over already? Two over. I got just got to win this. Let's spend our money. Get that there. This forest, not good to attack into. What's the maneuver? My maneuver is higher, isn't it? So I shouldn't. I have minus one penalty. Is that enough? Let's make sure one more. Jeez, I saved up a ton of money and now it's all gone. Right, so Pomeranian and Denmark are at war. Okay, probably gonna have to scrap half these mercs as well in a minute because I can't afford them. My approval isn't quite up yet, so I have to wait on that. Whoa, shit. Yeah, this is a one attempt. Yeah, so strike next. Oh, let's move in now. Okay, it's not capped though. I'm going to wait until the end of next month and then strike, make sure... Well, actually, there is, there is capped. Probably is, so I'm going to have to wait. Influenza. Right, whatever that is. Right, I'll do it. Right, so morale's capped. Let's take them on. Minus one. Our morale's better. But we got minus one. And it looks like we're winning. Oh wow, I didn't realize how many cavalry they have. Jeez. Right, they got a 4 1 1. Luckily, it's fire. So that's not going to be as. Well, if it was shock. Oh god. Roll to zero. If I roll bad, I will lose this. And they're rolling a nine. Right, nine. I think we're going to lose that. Fucking hell. What can I do? I 
I'm out of money. I've lost that. Fucking hell. Uh... One more unit and I probably would have won it. <sighs> Fuck. So... Oh, Lithuania's coming in. Come on, help me out, Lithuania. Please attack them. If, I don't, if someone doesn't attack them now, I'm not going to have the money. i got to... Right, thank God for that. Right, I think that's disaster averted, but it just cost me a ton of manpower and a ton of uh, money. Thank God uh, for allies. Eh? Okay, let's. As soon as I can, I'm gonna have to get rid of all these mercs in a second. Okay. Right, can I grab these yet? I've got this war against Novgorod. I need to start in a minute. Right, let's detach those. Uh. Group those up. How much force limit am I? Right. Not good. Let's consolidate there. Scrap you. Uh, let's turn off army maintenance. I don't need it on. Right. So I haven't gone bankrupt. or <laughs> have to take a ton of loans, but yeah, uh, money's not great. Uh, that army is enough to take on Novgorod, though. Let's start sieging up here. They can't rebel for a while because there's minus 20 on the province that have rebelled for quite some time. Recent uprising. So I don't think they're going to cause me a problem again. Uh, Teutonic separatists down here aren't causing me any issues whatsoever. It's just not enough unrest. I can't remember the last time I've had so many problems with rebels. I mean, didn't have too many from memory with no, Trevor's on Let's Play. That's when the rebels mechanics were changed the last time I played. Okay. I slept army. Mercs there. Right. Uh, what's that? Right, that's nowhere near. Still got miles away from happening. Okay. Did I core up all of these? No, I forgot. That's core up now. Probably been screaming at me, <laughs> watching this for ages. Why haven't you called up? Yeah, I forgot. Few things going on here. Right, so we took that back. Good. It's pointless. Right, Sweden's got that covered. I will stick one unit on it though, just in case for some reason they move off. I don't want the siege progress going. Nose. Can go there. Because Muscovy didn't take an awful lot of Novgorod, Novgorod's going to be stronger to start out, and also Muscovy isn't going to be as strong, so when I do take them on... Well, it's just unity, oh, it's because of um, these provinces. I'm going to take the Prestige till it's still probably more important than 10 amount. Muscovy declared one Kazan. Yeah, so I'm going to declare war on 
Novgorod on my own, then I'll probably try and get Lithuania, Sweden, Poland in on war against Rush, uh, Muscovy. So we'll have a rather large vassalized Muscovy by then. Got to take Riga at some stage, and then I've got to figure out who I'm going after next. Uh, around probably, well, one of the three big, either Sweden, Lithuania, or Poland, because that's about the only place I can expand to then, probably. Unless I could somehow come down here. Don't see quite how to like take those territories myself, but that might be a good idea if Lithuania wasn't independent, but they are. I'd really annoy them if I have all of those territories along their border. And I'd have problems with religion, religion trying to keep them under control as well. Unless I pick religious ideas for my first pick, which probably don't want to do really. Maybe second or third pick. Right, all done. Right, finally got through that. Brilliant.